Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's question is assuming no gene linkage in the hybrid cross of two genotypes with heterozygous genotype of F1 generation, what is the ratio of F1 gametes which is going to be as follows that will give rise to the F2 offspring. First of all, in order to solve this problem, you have to understand this problem. And here it is said that the hybrid cross of these two genotypes, this is not a dehybrid cross, we call this parental generation. So we have parent one, which is homozygous dominant for the gene A, homozygous dominant for the gene B, and we cross with another parent that is homozygous recessive for both genes. So let's say this is going to be parent one and this is going to be parent two. And we call this parental generation. And next generation is going to be F1 generation. And of course, genotype of F1 generation is going to be uniform and it's going to be capital A small a and capital B small b. Again, we call this F1 generation. And we have to cross with itself in order to get next generation, which we call F2 generation. So we have to cross with the same uh, genotype. And as you see, now in F1 generation, we have the hybrid cross here. So parent one is hybrid for gene A and hybrid for the gene B, or we also call this heterozygous. And parent two having the same genotype is also going to be the hybrid for both genes. So this is what we call the hybrid cross. And this is how we are going to get uh, next generation, which is going to be F2 generation. But unlike F1 generation, which is going to be genetically uniform in F2 generation, we are going to get segregation of traits and are going to get many different genotypes. But the question is um, what is going to be a ratio of one gametes, F1 generation gametes. So uh, what kind of gametes this generation are going to produce and in what ratio? Take a look. We can take any of these parents. Both parents have the same genotype. So let's take, for example, the first one. Gametes are haploid, so would have only one allele from each allelic pair. So the first variant would be capital A and capital B genotype. Second variant would be capital A and small b genotype. Another variant would be small a and capital B genotype. And the last variant would be small a and small b genotype. And as you see, the probability of each type of the gamut is going to be the same. So we are going to have one to one to one to one ratio. And this is answer A. One more time to be clear, this is not the genotype of the F2 generation. This is genotypes of the gametes of the F1 generation. And this is a question of the problem. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.